77% of online shopping carts are abandoned. That's more than three quarters. It's six slices of an eight slice pizza. A pineapple and sausage pizza. Why do so many customers abandon their carts? And why does pineapple and sausage pizza taste so very good? Hi, I'm Molly from Active Campaign. And I'm Tim from Active Campaign. We have a question from our community that, that we're, we're going, going to answer. answer. Today, we have a question that asks, can someone please show me how to implement abandoned cart functionality? We have you covered. Today, let's talk about abandoned carts. Why do 77% of people abandon their carts? Maybe they got distracted. Maybe they forgot they even have a cart. Maybe they don't like the price. Or maybe they were just browsing. Abandoned cart emails are a super effective way to recover carts and improve sales. Research shows that abandoned cart emails have an average open rate of 43% and an average click-through rate of 21%. And half of those people make a purchase. That means that a single abandoned cart email could turn 10% of the people it's sent to into customers. But what if you sent more than just one? Using multiple abandoned cart emails gives you more opportunities to win back customers. This can be accomplished using ActiveCampaign's e-commerce integrations with platforms like Shopify and WooCommerce. You can use the provided abandons cart trigger to automatically start an automation when a contact abandons a cart in your store. Let's explore what an abandoned cart email series could look like, starting with email number one, the one hour email. The one hour email is your first line of defense once the cart has been abandoned. In this first email, there's really no need to get fancy. It's tempting to throw in related products, coupons, or jazzy images. But because this is a series of emails, we'll have time for all of that stuff later. Right now, we just have to remind them of what they're missing. Include a simple reminder, an image of your product, and a single call to action. And that's it. This brings us to email number two, the one day later email. There are many reasons someone might have missed your first email. Maybe they left work and you have their work email. Maybe they were shopping at night and just went to sleep. Shopping at night is the best. With the second email, you have more possibilities. Did someone open your first email but not convert? Tweak the email content, highlight a different benefit or offer social proof. Did someone fail to open your email entirely? Consider resending your first email with a different subject line. Let's talk about email number three, the three to five day email. Your visitor has gotten two abandoned cart emails and still hasn't become a customer. It's time to follow up one more time. Why is this the last email in this series? Why not keep sending more and more emails until your contact converts? Chances are, if someone abandons a cart and then ignores three abandoned cart emails, they're probably not gonna make a purchase. Regardless of why they weren't interested in the first place, you don't wanna keep spamming them because they may mark your emails as spam. Before you give up, you've got one last trick up your sleeve, a coupon. Coupons can be tricky. You don't wanna put a coupon too early in your abandoned cart series because people will learn that abandoning their cart is a quick way to get a discount. If you use coupons too often, you train people to wait for discounts before buying. But after three to five days, you've probably converted all the people who are already interested in your products. A 10% off coupon might just be enough to convince the others. One effective technique is to offer a coupon to new customers who abandon their carts. This is a clever way to increase first time buyers while not encouraging repeat customers to game the system by abandoning their carts. Once someone recovers an abandoned cart, they're a customer. And you can use the information you have to target them with cross-sells, upsells, and relevant offers. All because you decided to keep pushing after that first email failed. There we have it. We had a question from our community that we were going to answer. And, and we, we did. did. Don't forget, like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this.